Welcome, viewers. Get ready for a captivating journey through time, told through a series of captivating historical photographs. Each image carries its own unique story, capturing moments of joy, surprise, defiance, and human spirit. Now, let's dive into these remarkable slices of the past together. The, our visual journey begins in 1930, when an adorable chauffeur dog was humorously posed to appear in control of a car. Its paw on the steering wheel and its concentration focused on the road ahead, as if taking its unseen passengers on a leisurely drive. This whimsical image depicts a time when animals were often anthropomorphized for amusing photographs. Fast forward to a chilly December in 1954 at the Fun Fair in London. We find two passengers in an electric car with expressions of bewilderment upon encountering Susie Bear. Their surprised faces mirror the charm and unexpected encounters synonymous with amusement parks during this period. But next, we're taken to a somber scene on August 29, 1944. Three members of the Resistance Patrol Paris to root out lingering German snipers. At the heart of this trio, Simone Seguin, an 18-year-old Frenchwoman, is seen poised and determined, embodying the courage and resilience of the French Resistance. By the May 1966, the unconventional fashion of the swinging 60s is on full display in the window of Lady Jane Boutique. Attracting crowds of onlookers and journalists, models boldly reveal lingerie designs in a public display that shocks and fascinates in equal measure. This event encapsulates the era's daring push against societal norms. A leap back in time to Washington, 1927, reveals an endearing scene of young girls walking ducklings in a drinker. Their carefree laughter and innocence offer a delightful reminder of simple pleasures in a time before technology transformed leisure. Now we visit a Parisian studio in 1875, a pivotal year in the construction of the iconic Statue of Liberty. This awe-inspiring snapshot depicts the assembly of Liberty's left arm, the sheer scale of which speaks to the immense ambition and effort that went into the monument's creation. Of a sunny day on Jersey Beach, June 29, 1935. Two sailors from HMS Fury enjoy a relaxed smoke, flanked by two women in bathing suits. The photograph encapsulates the spirit of leisure and camaraderie that occasionally punctuated naval service in this era. The Picture Post was an influential magazine in 1938, thanks largely to Hutton, a founder and photographer. One of his most famous works portrays a working-class girl delighting in the excitement of an amusement park in South and Essex. Her radiant smile captures the simple, wholesome pleasure of her day out. On December 24, 1936, atop the Empire State Building, a fearless window cleaner takes a break to pose for a photograph. Suspended high above the streets of New York, his casual demeanor contrasts dramatically with the vertiginous backdrop, inviting the viewer to marvel at his audacity. The 1960s reveal three American girls engaging in hushed gossip in an alley in Seville, Spain. This candid moment, popularized as a postcard, beautifully captures their shared secret and their transformation into little adults. In 1978, the flamboyant queen frontman, Freddie Mercury, gives an unconventional autograph to a stripper, signing her posterior. This image is a testament to the wild and eccentric spirit of rock and roll in its golden era. But rather serious moment in 1947, New York, USA, as a man is seen administering inoculations to three women. This moment in public health history reflects the importance of vaccines in the fight against disease, a fight that continues today. A laid-back summer's day in 1959 in Deauville, France, a young woman relaxes in a bikini, sipping on a refreshing juice. Her contented pose captures the essence of the era's emerging youth culture and freedom. An intimate scene from 1995 shows pop icon Madonna and her loyal Doberman sitting at a table. Shot for verses, this intriguing photograph reflects Madonna's unorthodox and rebellious persona, as well as the symbiosis between celebrity culture and high fashion. June 28, 1949, atop a London roof, three Cambridge theatre actresses, including a young Audrey Hepburn, seek respite from the heat by huddling around a large block of ice. This charming and candid moment provides a rare glimpse into the lives of these iconic actresses behind the scenes. Next, we witness a Kankin performance in New York City in 1949. The dancers' dynamic high-kicking movements are frozen in time, perfectly capturing the energy and spirit of this iconic French dance. Marilyn Monroe, the glamorous starlet of the 1950s, 
responds to criticism in a humorous fashion. After being criticized for looking cheap and vulgar in a red dress, Marilyn arranges a photo shoot wearing a sack, proving that her beauty and charisma are undiminished, regardless of her attire. The 1956 Miss Polonia Beauty Contest, held on a rooftop in Poland. A contestant is seen demonstrating her poise and confidence. This image speaks to the spectacle and excitement that has long surrounded beauty pageants. But an iconic image from 1945, the joyous VJ Day in Times Square, American sailor Glenn McGuffey sweeps nurse Edith Shane into an impromptu and passionate kiss, embodying the collective relief and euphoria marking the end of World War II. Love of a stark scene from New York, 1972, presents a detained prostitute in a police station. This candid photograph reveals the darker, less glamorized aspects of urban life and societal issues during this period. But we find the stunning Ava Gardner, Hollywood's classic beauty, sunbathing leisurely on a beach. This candid image captures her natural allure, reminding us of a time when the silver screen was graced by such timeless stars. A delightful family moment featuring Princess Diana and her family during a holiday on Necker Island in 1990. The image beautifully captures the princess's warmth, her love for her children, and her unique place in the public's heart. But Hollywood icon Kirk Douglas shows off his physical prowess by lifting two women. This playful moment encapsulates Douglas's on- and off-screen persona as a paragon of strength and masculinity. But a unique artifact from the Prohibition era, the liquor cane, serves as a covert means to carry alcohol in 1922. This clever accessory captures the spirit of rebellion and inventiveness that often arises in response to restrictive laws. Our visual journey concludes with a somewhat shocking and unconventional scene. A woman, depicted in her natural form, has tumbled from her bicycle. This provocative photograph, likely intended as a candid exploration of the human body and its interaction with ordinary objects, also serves as a stark reminder of the precarious balance we all maintain in our day-to-day -day lives.